Exercise 1, Mid-Upper Arm Circumference Measurement and Checking for Edema. Almaz Habicho, 24 months old, was sent by community volunteers from Korogoti to Alaba Health Post for further nutritional evaluation. Almaz's mother reported that the child was suffering from on and off type of watery diarrhea three to four times per day for more than a month, but the diarrhea has stopped two weeks ago. The mother also mentioned that Almaz was vaccinated completely, but the vaccination card was lost. She did not take vitamin A supplementation and tablets for intestinal worms during the last month's campaign. Almaz has not been breastfeeding since six months ago. She's taking whatever food is available at home. The health extension worker asks the mother to keep Almaz standing erect and removes the clothing that covers her left arm. The health extension worker will estimate the midpoint of the left upper arm. Straighten the arm and wrap the mid-upper arm circumference tape around the midpoint, making sure the numbers are right side up. The health extension worker makes sure the tape is flat around the skin and inspects the tension is not too tight or loose. The health extension worker reads the mid-upper arm circumference and records the reading. Please write the mid-upper arm circumference measurement of Almas that you read. How much did you read? We read the mid-upper arm circumference of Almas to be 10.4 centimeters. What is your interpretation of the mid-upper arm circumference measurement of Almaz? Is she severely malnourished based on the mid-upper arm circumference measurement? A child aged 6 months to 18 years has severe acute malnutrition if the mid-upper arm circumference measurement is less than 11 centimeters. The mid-upper arm circumference measurement of Almaz is 10.4 centimeters, and she's 24 months old. Therefore, Almaz has severe acute malnutrition since her mid-upper arm circumference measurement is less than 11 centimeters. Health extension worker will apply normal thumb pressure on both feet of Almaz for 3 seconds and check for the presence of shallow print. Do you see shallow print or indentation on both feet? Does Almaz have pitting edema of both feet? We didn't see any shallow print, therefore Almaz does not have pitting edema of both feet. Pitting edema of both feet should be present in case of nutritional edema, which is a sign of severe acute malnutrition. The mid-upper arm circumference measurement of Almaz is 10.4 centimeters, and she does not have pitting edema of both feet. Almaz has severe acute malnutrition because her mid-upper arm circumference measurement is less than 11 centimeters. Zuriash brought her 12-month child Tariku to the health post after being worried about the swelling of both feet. The swelling started to appear three weeks ago and the mother tried to apply some herbal medication but got no improvement. Tariku has no cough, blood in the stool, but has on and off fever. He has no abnormal body movement and has been vomiting one to two times per day. Tariku is vaccinated regularly up to nine months in the health post and all the records are available. Zuriash mentioned that they are living in the Kolla part of SNMPR. Do you think Tariku has pitting edema of both feet? We have seen shallow print on both feet after applying thumb pressure for three seconds. Therefore, Tariku has pitting edema of both feet. Does Tariku have severe acute malnutrition? Tariku has severe acute malnutrition because he has pitting edema of both feet. Jamila has brought her 13 months old child Muhammad to health post for nutritional checkup. Muhammad has no edema on the feet and has no cough, fever, or diarrhea. Jamila worried that her child doesn't look strong like other children of the same age in the community. The mother mentioned Muhammad took all the vaccinations as per appointment. 
Do you see any indentation on Muhammad's feet? Does he have pitting edema of both feet? We didn't see any indentation on both feet. Therefore, Muhammad doesn't have pitting edema of both feet. The health extension worker will do the mid-upper arm circumference measurement. Please write the mid-upper arm circumference measurement of Muhammad that you read. How much did you read? The mid-upper arm circumference measurement of Muhammad is 11.6 centimeters. Therefore, he has moderate acute malnutrition since the mid-upper arm circumference greater or equal to 11 centimeters and less than 12 centimeters and no edema. Muhammad does not have severe acute malnutrition, but he does have moderate acute malnutrition. Mm -hmm.